one in eight women will be diagnosed with breast cancer in their lifetime. Inside Science TV. The fact is, you have probably either had, will have, or know somebody who has had breast cancer. Why one person gets the disease and another doesn't is not completely known. What doctors do know is that breast cancer can be caused by damaged DNA inside a cell. That cell mutates and multiplies over and over. The good news, earlier detection, increased awareness, better treatments and technology means it's more likely than ever before patients will survive it. Many women have a phase where they have non-invasive cancer or in situ. Anti-hormone drugs are a common treatment for this type of breast cancer. And now, oncologists at Northwestern are developing a gel for the skin that goes on the outside of the breast to kill the cancer. You could put tamoxifen in a gel and apply it to the breast skin and that it would get through the skin in sufficient concentrations that it would actually do what it needed to in the breast, but the exposure of the rest of the body would be low. The gel is made out of the drug tamoxifen that's already used to treat and prevent breast cancer. Unlike other typical cancer medications, the gel treatment is confined to the breast, lowering the risk of damage to other organs. There are many reasons to expect that this would be a really positive change in the way we uh, deliver drugs to the breast for these early problems. Early studies have found the gel form of tamoxifen stopped cancer cell growth just as well as tamoxifen pills and caused fewer side effects. It could be several years before the gel is on the market, but early study results are giving it the thumbs up in the fight against some non-invasive cancers. Inside Science TV. If you enjoyed this edition, follow us on the web and social media. Powered by the American Institute of Physics and a coalition of underwriters.